And here we go in this anything goes match. Here we go. All three competitors in the ring at the same time. Remember, this is a no disqualification matchup, which means anything goes here tonight. What's your take on Hideo Tommy tonight? Finn Balor's coup de grace is quickly becoming one of my favorite signature moves in all of WWE. It's so simple, yet so effective. A ton of talent, a ton of ability, certainly someone to keep an eye on. Hideo and Tommy doesn't know what hit him. Look out what's going on here. Get ready, folks! Get ready! And this heartless attack continues. Oh, man. This is getting tough to watch. Drops the knee with a vengeance. Oh, man. He came down hard with that. That's paralyzing. It won't take long to lose the use of that arm. King, I don't think Finn Balor is upon to share the same appreciation for the coup de grace that you have. What? What? It has to be terrifying to look up and see Balor flying through the air, about to come down on your chest. Yeah, you're right. And he doesn't just come down on your chest. He really drives those feet in. Almost like he's trying to cave the chest in. Nobody home there. Nobody home? Cole, that looked like the house has been empty for months. And Hideo with Tommy reverses it. Look out what's going on here. Look out. Oh, wow. And he's toast. When I see him attack the arm, it reminds me of how WWE Hall of Famer Arn Anderson would incapacitate an opponent's arm. Yeah, they actually should have called him Arm Anderson. Uh-oh. Big trouble for Finn Balor. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Finn Balor. Seeing attacks to the back of the head reminds me how thankful I am to be sitting right here. Yeah, I wish I were as thankful. at complete domination here. Ow! Ooh. Oh, wait, nice reversal. Well, that messed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. Look at the pain on his face after that neck breaker. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. Oh, that one hit the mark. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. He's got him hooked. And Hideo with Tommy reverses it. Nothing fancy from him there. That was all raw power. Uh, nothing like a great body slam. Classic. Well, we're on the move here. He's too good inside the ring to be out on the floor for long. I don't agree with you, King. Hideo with Tommy showing us how to get it done. Today, too fast. He's setting it up. We know what's coming here. Oh my! Put it in the books. This one's got to be over now. Man, he's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously wrong there. Look at this. This could be it. This the coup de grace is going to be. The coup de grace. Does the coup de grace mean this thing's over? A oh, quick pin. Can he do it? And the shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. He's showing the heart of a warrior here tonight. Uh-oh. That looked 
ugly. I mean, and it sounded even worse. Yeah, that really had to hurt. Boy, he's really done his homework for this match. Going for the cover. And the referee's count's interrupted there. Well, it just goes to show you that an attack can come from anywhere where you're in that ring. Not a lot of spring left in his step right now. Having come up through the dojos in Japan, Finn Balor brings a certain toughness to him in the ring that not everybody possesses. And you'd have to credit Finn Balor's time in Japan for his extensive knowledge in submission wrestling. There are no allies in matches of this nature, but I wouldn't be surprised to see a temporary union in a little two-on-one battle taking place. Oh, and he stops the count. What action. Look out. There's not a lot of cushion for your face. As you can see, everything hurts. No kidding. That's hurting me. Just making his presence felt there. Hideo Itami reversing it. Incredible. Look at this energy from Finn Balor. Look at these moves. This is Awesome. I don't know how he does it. I've been in the business a long time, and I haven't seen anyone with the energy and ability of Finn Balor. Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. Bringing it back between the ropes. And that's a good thing. Look at Finn Balor here. I'm not sure I can watch this. Finn Balor smells blood, folks. Look at this. He's just barely moving. I'm not sure he can get back to his feet. He's making a statement here with this attack. That landed perfectly. Here we go. I can't tell you how many victims have suffered the same fate. Extra slow getting back to his base here. I'll be shocked if that's not it. <laughs> Did you see that? Almost don't want to see what's... This should do it right there. I think this is it. Two. And the referee's count's interrupted there. Well, it just goes to show you that an attack can come from anywhere when you're in that ring. Oh, out of nowhere! And into the... They're still alive. Yeah, Cole, you remember that song back in the day? Staying alive? Well, that was it in WWE terms. with authority. What authority? I think the canvas screamed in pain on that one. Quick! Someone check the mat. This match has taken so much out of this guy. He's not going to give up. But the coup de grace is going to be the coup de grace. Does the coup de grace mean this thing's over? There's the pan. Ken is upon a kick out. Two. 